Hi, I'm Dr. Meg Lainson. I work for Shaw Pet Hospitals, and this is Dr. Nick Shaw. And this is Snuffles, and Snuffles is a uh, um, obviously a rabbit and I know we've had a whole lot of controversy about rabbits around the Victoria area but the important thing about snuffles and um, domestic rabbits is they make wonderful pets. Um, they're, they're calm, they can be trained to a litter box, um, they are easy to feed, um, easy to take care of, very personable and very loving and um, very gentle, very very gentle. Um, they do have some problems associated with the fact that they're bunnies and probably the biggest problem that they have is a very um, strong susceptibility to a bacterial infection. It's called Pasteurella. Pasteurella bacteria can cause uh, respiratory disease and nasal discharge and sneezing and so on. That's how it got its name. But it's an even nastier bacteria than that because it can get internally into the rabbit and cause abscesses that can cause all kinds of problems inside, even brain abscesses and things like that. And in some cases it can be phenomenally difficult or even impossible to treat successfully. So one of the keys is trying to uh, prevent pastorellosis in rabbits. And the best way to do that is to make sure that your rabbit doesn't associate with any wild rabbits. And that's really kind of hard to do in certain places in Victoria but if you have your rabbit outside they really need to be double um, uh, caged away from wild bunnies because that's the way that they pick it up. Um, pastorella can cause incredibly serious head tilt where the actual head of the bunny will tilt sideways. There are a couple of other things that do that as well but if you've got a bunny that all of a sudden starts to turn the head on the side and the ears are pointed this way instead of straight up then you've got a condition that you really do need to treat. So that's just one disease that you can do a lot uh, about um, if you keep your bunnies away from the wild bunny population. Bunnies also have a lot of gastrointestinal problems because they have such a complicated gastrointestinal tract. Maybe we can talk about that on an upcoming segment of Island 30.